The Center for Research in the Arts, Social Sciences and Humanities CRASSH, is an interdisciplinary research center within the University of Cambridge for collaboration between researchers from the arts, social sciences and humanities. The center is independent of any university department but works with both the School of Arts and Humanities, and the School of Humanities and Social Sciences. Founded in 2001, CRASSH celebrated its 10th anniversary by welcoming Professor Simon Goldhill as its new director and moving from Mill Lane, to the Allison Richard Building at 7 West Road, as well as inaugurating a new series of public lectures, which in 2011 were on the idea of the university and in 2012 Understanding Society. <laughs> new Building, 7 West Road At beginning of 2012, CRASSH moved into the new Allison Richard Building at the West Road Gateway to the University's Sidgwick site, the main base for humanities and social science teaching and research at Cambridge. The building was designed by Nicholas Hare Architects and received a commendation at the 2013 Civic Trust Awards. The move into 7 West Road provides in-house space for larger conferences, but also creates greater interaction with old and new constituencies. The center's relocation puts CRASSH alongside the major regional studies centers and POLIS, the Department of Politics and International Studies. The building is also home to Edmund de Waal's first piece of public sculpture, A Local History, a commission of three vitrines filled with porcelain and sunk into the pavement outside the building. <laughs> <laughs> Directors Ian Donaldson 2001-3 Deputy Director John Morrill 2001-4 Ludmilla Jordanova 2003-5 Mary Jacobus 2005-11 Andrew Weber Sabbatical Director 2009-10 Simon Goldhill 2011 Topic: <laughs> Management Committee Ashar Meen FBA 1931 Chair in Geography, Department of Geography Graham Barker Disney Professor of Archaeology, Head, Department of Archaeology, Director, MacDonald Institute for Archaeological Research William Arthur Brown Montague Burton Professor of Industrial Relations, Faculty of Economics, Chair, School of Humanities and Social Sciences, Master, Darwin College Tim Crane Knightbridge Professor of Philosophy, Faculty of Philosophy Simon Franklin, Professor, Department of Slavonic Studies, Chair, School of Arts and Humanities Simon Goldhill, Professor in Greek Literature and Culture, Faculty of Classics, Director, CRASSH 2011 Caroline Humphrey, Sigrid Rousing Professor of Collaborative Anthropology, Department of Social Anthropology, Fellow of the British Academy Hans van der Ven, Professor of Modern Chinese History, Faculty of Asian and Middle Eastern Studies Megan Vaughan, Smuts Professor of Commonwealth History, Faculty of History, Director, Centre of African Studies, Fellow of the British Academy Andrew Weber, Professor of Modern German and Comparative Culture, Department of German Advisory Board Danielle Allen, UPS Foundation Professor, Institute of Advanced Study, Princeton Homi Bhava and F. Rothenberg Professor of English and American Literature and Language, Director, The Humanities Centre, Harvard University Jeffrey Krosick, Former Vice-Chancellor, University of London Lorraine Daston, Director, Max Planck Institute for the History of Science, Berlin David Edgerton, Professor of the History of Science and Technology, Imperial College, London Connor Geerty, Professor of Law, London School of Economics Martin Hudger, Professor of Public Policy, University of Amsterdam Baroness Honora O'Neill of Bengrave, House of Lords Deborah Proposal, Director, Wits Institute for Economic and Social Research, Richard Sennett, Professor of Sociology, London School of Economics and NYU, Sally Shuttleworth, Professorial Fellow in English, Head of Humanities, Oxford, Quentin Skinner, Barbara Beaumont, Professor of the Humanities, Queen Mary, University of London, Dame Marilyn Strathen, Professor of Anthropology, Deborah Swallow, Marit Rousing Director, Courtauld Institute, London, Lord Wilson of Dinton, Master of Emmanuel College, Cambridge. Topic. Major research projects 
CRASSH is home to numerous major, long-term research projects. The cluster of early modern related projects has ensured that CRASSH is one of the largest centers for early modern studies in Europe. Bible and Antiquity in 19th Century Culture, 2012–17 Cambridge Centre for Digital Knowledge, 2014–17 Technology and Democracy, 2014–17 The Concept Lab, 2014–17 Cambridge Digital Humanities Strategic Network, 2011–14 Conspiracy and Democracy, 2013–17 Conversions Crossroads of Knowledge in Early Modern England, The Place of Literature, 2014–19 Genius Before Romanticism, Ingenuity in Early Modern Art and Science 2014 to 19 limits of the numerical 2015 to 18 making visible the visual and graphic practices of the early royal society 2015 to 2019 Mellon Center for disciplinary innovation 2011 to 15 seeing things early modern visual and material culture center for the study of existential risk the history of cross-cultural comparatism visual representations of the third plague pandemic topic Graduate, faculty research groups The graduate, faculty program supports students and faculty working together around shared interdisciplinary research interests. The groups act as a barometer for disciplinary development and curriculum change. This program is funded by the Isaac Newton Trust and the Andrew W. Mellon. Conferences. The Conference Support Program functions as a showcase for arts, social sciences and humanities research in action. It provides the opportunity for Cambridge scholars to broker local and international collaborations. Recent and upcoming conferences include The Future University, Migration in Legal and Political Theory, Art, Memory and Dictatorship in Latin America, Languages of Citizenship in Translation, Still Architecture and Medieval Church Screens. Topic. Fellowships and postdoctoral researchers The Center offers a number of programs to bring scholars from all over the world to CRASSH. The fellowship schemes allow a community of scholars, from postdoctoral and early career researchers to more established visiting fellows, to interact in an interdisciplinary research environment. Topic. Media and outreach The center reaches out globally through its Facebook site and through making available recordings of an increasing number of events online, in our media gallery and via the Cambridge YouTube and Atunezu channels Twitter Facebook Media Gallery University of Cambridge Streaming Media Service YouTube Topic. Press clippings Edmund de Waal's Commission A Local History Times Higher Education, DH23 Digital Tools Program Former Director Mary Jacobus awarded CBE Understanding Society Financial Times, The Diary, Edmund de Waal Leverhulme Trust, Conspiracy and Democracy Guardian, What are Universities for? Humanitas Visiting Professor in Media, Manuel Casteths Research Horizons how to say I love you in Greenlandic Humanitas Visiting Professorship in Chamber Music, Professor Alfred Brendel The Arts and Humanities, Endangered Species Climate Histories Digital Diasporas, How Migrant Communities Are Embracing New Media See also University of Cambridge Humanities Social Sciences Arts <laughs>